What's up you guys and welcome to the first episode of 12 days of vlogmas. I'm gonna be vlogging every day until Christmas so make sure you got those post notifications on. Today is Sunday and y'all probably know this by now maybe you relate yourself but Sundays are my days where I like clean my house, do my laundry, wash my sheets, my towels and today we're also gonna be doing a little self glow up. So I want to tan today, I want to do my hair, I want to put some nails on. So we're gonna see how we can do this transformation but as of right now I'm just enjoying my morning coffee and I just posted a vlog so I'm gonna reply to comments. I think make a little breakfast, and then really get into this. Cheers, let me know what you're drinking down below. but I kind of want to do my skincare routine but before I if I'm gonna do my skincare routine I want to shower but before I, I want to shower I want to do this yoga video so I'm gonna do that yeah The Bondi Sands. I don't know if I said it wrong before. I usually like this one in dark. I think I'm gonna try the one hour one today just because I I have way more of this than this. So I use this and probably my number one tip for a do-it-yourself tan is the foam. Don't know if y'all remember in 2015. I don't know if I ever made a video about it, but this company sent me this tanning lotion, so runny. It was so streaky, it would dry so fast, so if it like dripped down your leg or something, that would be there. But I feel like this one is pretty natural and easy to use, and I just, I don't know, I never have a problem with it. So I'm gonna use this, I'm not gonna film it, because I'm gonna get completely naked, but... Uh, can y'all sponsor me, please? So I'm gonna get kind of like dry, but dude, it's so green. If you self tan, you know that sometimes it can be like green when you put it on before you like wash it off. And this one compared to like the normal one, not the one that the one hour one. Literally when I like sprayed it into the mitt, I was like, why does it look literally green? Like not hinto green, like green. There was a thing he apparently he gave everybody chlamydia at NYU. <laughs> it's like an actual thing. to be finished so I can put my sheets on my bed and get a vacuum my room and like Windex the side tables and stuff. Y'all, I don't know if I should be saying this because I don't know if this is like bad or you're not supposed to do this. <laughs> if y'all know, I have this iMac here and it's kind of an older one. I don't really use it that much just because it's kind of slow, but I'll use it for like music or mostly just for this clock, honestly. The screen was so dirty and I think it's because it's like out here by the kitchen, but it was the kind of like, almost like a grease film 
If you know, you know, that shit is so hard to clean. It's like, how do you clean that? So I have this glass stove top cleaner and it's literally never looked cleaner. Like, I don't know if you're as shocked as me because I don't know if you know how dirty and gross it was before, but it actually looks like a normal screen now. Shocked, it's like, that's all it took, are you serious? Anyway, <laughs> can't wait to wash this tan off. I have like probably an hour left and then we can really start the personal blow up. between my face and my body. I actually love how it turned out. It looks very natural. So I think I'm gonna do just like an eyebrow and maybe, ew, maybe some mascara. I just feel like it. I'm literally not going anywhere, but. Um, so now I'm gonna glue these nails on. They are just press-on nails from Amazon that I painted. Try to do this kind of like curved design, but I don't know how it's gonna look because it's clear. I don't know, I just don't know. So I have this acrylic set, but I don't think I'm gonna acrylic them. I'm just going to put the nail prep, which kind of dries your nails out so it sticks better, and then this primer, and then just use nail glue. And I'm, I'm gonna watch some vlogs while I do that. So I actually don't mind the nails. They don't look weird at all with the clear, actually. Okay, okay. I'm starving. I feel like my little oatmeal did not fill me up. Or it did, but like very temporarily. So I'm just gonna make some shrimp pasta right now. Yeah, I'm like so hungry that I feel like weak. So you know those vibes. Oh. But yeah, let me make this and I've shown you guys this so many times, but I'll show you what it looks like at the end anyway. Let me try. Mm. I added some white wine. Bitch. Boom, so I'm gonna eat this. Um, watch some TV, honestly, watch some more vlogs, probably. And I'll check back in with you guys after. I feel like I'm excited to just sit down. I feel like I've been like, I know I have sat a little bit today, but I feel like I've just been like cleaning a lot and like on my feet, honestly, so I'm excited. So I finished my food. I also made some kale. If you deal with like stomach issues or you have trouble digesting stuff sometimes, I just feel like my stomach can be so sensitive. And I remember in acupuncture, she said one of the things to help with that is eating a lot of leafy, like dark leafy greens and like, like cooked leafy greens. So I definitely try to eat a lot of kale and like spinach mostly every day. Y'all probably see me do that. But it literally helps so much with just that feeling. I don't know. It's like, if you know, you know. So we be dealing, we be coping with that. I was watching Jersey Shore, just kind of some comfort TV. And now we have a metal fireplace back on. This ASMR, it really like makes you feel cozy. And now I'm getting some editing done. But dude, let me know if you were late. I feel like most of the time I'm able to practice gratitude and I'm not like an impulsive person. So let me just like explain the situation. Sometimes I get in these modes or like moods, I don't know, where it's like, I feel like I'm in a wanting mood. It's like, oh, I'm sick of everything. Like I just wanna do, like today I feel like I was thinking about how I want a new apartment. And then I was thinking about how, like all the different stuff I could like do. Like I was like, oh, like watching BBL vlogs and like, like, oh, I could do that. Like I wanna do that. Thinking about like my cat, which that's kind of different, but I'm like, oh, I want that. Thinking about a car, oh, I want this car. And then I was just looking at tattoos and like, oh, I wanna get a tattoo. But it's like this specific mood. So let me know if you ever get into a state like that. It's like almost like you're 
you just want to start over. I have been noticing this all day, like I'm aware of it. And so I've been trying to remind myself, like come back to the moment and like everything you have right now. And I guess like when, at least for me, I know when I want stuff, it's like, you want the feeling it's gonna bring you, you know, most of the time, like sometimes things are just simply practical or necessary or whatever. But like, like if I'm in one of those moods where it's just like, I feel like I want to start my life over like aesthetically, do this, do that. Like, I just want a new look. I want, you know, everything like, and I just feel like it's kind of a waste of energy because it's one thing to make a mood board or a vision board and like be excited about something or have goals or like, it's normal to almost want stuff. But I feel like this specific mood is just like, I'm bored. So I'm creating this like almost fantasy in my head. Like, oh, my life could be so different if I did this, if I got this done, if I like got this random tattoo. Like, I just, I don't like being in that kind of mood I've realized because it's just like, again, it's one thing to set goals or to like, oh, I kind of want to do this. Or like, I want to do this. I'm going to work towards this goal. But it's another thing to just randomly want your whole life to be different, like silly stuff like, I hope this is making sense. Anyway, I'm like, okay, if I like did this or got this or whatever, how would my life be different? And it's like, why can't I just act that way now? So uh, thinking about that, but at least I'm catching myself, you know, it's just like, it's not even like a I'm not grateful thing. It's just like new everything, like da da da. <laughs> like I'm not upset. It's like, I'm in a good mood about it. I'm just like, oh, I wanna do this, I wanna do that. But it's like, relax like why i don't know if i'm articulating it correctly like how i actually feel but anyway i guess i never showed you guys my like i guess i kind of did my glow up yeah i didn't do a makeup or anything crazy because i just didn't feel like it today but it feels good to start the week off with nails and a tan and my hair you know just like i know when i wake up tomorrow and brush my hair it's gonna be still like smooth clean house clean sheets clean towels and honestly a mental glow up too you know we've been checking ourselves throughout this whole day i honestly had a good day and i'm so excited for this mini vlogmas that i'm doing so thank you guys so much for watching thank you so much for the love on the past vlog that i posted make sure you have post notifications on comment on the video like it all of that and i will see you guys tomorrow oh my god i'm so excited yeah i think i'm just gonna end the vlog here it's like, that's it <laughs> okay bye guys